We all know that. Yes. Oh, I just love it. All right, but first, okay. A documentary about basketball phenom Jackie Stiles is set to debut at the Galois tomorrow night. But we didn't want to make you wait, so here's a sneak peek. Crawling left angle, Stiles with it. Jackie right by Johnson to the hoop, lays it up and in. Oh, that's the way to get this baby started. Jackie Stiles is probably the best basketball player you've never seen. Jackie was the best pure shooter that I have seen in the game up to today. We'll look back in 50 years and just be stunned. When I saw her for the first time, I thought there's no way she's scoring all those points at the next level. Then we get to practice the most amazing thing I've ever seen in all of my life. And the legend simply expanded. You just witnessed one of the best college basketball players you've ever seen, man or woman. Every time they needed a basket, there was no question who was going to shoot the ball. It was going to be Jackie. We all watched this player put her team on her shoulders and basically take it places it had never been. She never bragged. She just went on the court and outplayed people. They're calling her Pete Maravich with a ponytail. And the ponytail assassin, as she was called, didn't let anyone down. Jackie's on another planet. She was not focused on records or any kind of personal accolades. It was all about winning. As a coach, I just sat back. I turned to my assistant and said, we are witnessing history right here. The media pressure on Jackie prior to that was something that was unlike anything we'd ever seen in Springfield for anything. We knew that it was the person that was getting the rebounds or the person that was handling the ball or the person that was our best defender was just as important as me, the one scoring the points, and we truly believe that. Her heart on the court and her drive, it was fantastic, but it also hurt her. I feel bad for Jackie because you can work hard and then all of a sudden your body breaks down. When the injury started, it was very, very difficult for me to handle because I didn't know who I was without basketball and having to sit out and watch was a very challenging time. Essentially, for the world, she disappears. She's gone, and she has to figure out what to do with her life, and she's doing this in virtual silence. It's kind of like hearing about a legend like Jackie Styles. Just when they would think they found a way to stop her, she would pull something else out of the hat. You were like, did she really just shoot that jumper left-handed? Her thousand shots per day is legendary. Her breaking her right shooting hand. She's right-handed kid. She still is averaging over 25. How crazy is that? You would never in a million years, if you didn't know who she was, think she had done what she has done. She had to be able to score against people that were bigger, stronger, faster than her. That's what made her so great. Everybody didn't determine this kid was gonna do all these things. She's definitely a pioneer for this game of women's basketball, and as a pioneer, I don't feel like you always hear about those stories of the women who have gotten women like me to this point. What are you here for? To watch Jackie Styles. There would be a fan whose last dying wish was to meet Jackie Styles, and Jackie would go to the hospital. But she's not going to leave a kid without an autograph who stood in line. That's Jackie Styles. It's like, who does this, right? Oh, my goodness. Powerful stuff right there. Yeah. You know yeah. one of the best parts? What? She shared it with us. Yeah. We were around when she was doing this. Oh, I know. It this was is, the greatest. Way, yeah. way cool. Guess what? Huh. 
She's here. She's in the studio. And we have the director, Brent Huff, as well as the legend herself. There they are. Hey, guys. <laughs> They're going to talk about the big events. So don't go away. Ozarks Live is just getting started. Ha, ha, ha.